50 years ago, there have been Swiss and German families being in Hong Kong. They wanted to have a German education and a German school system for their, for their children. We still have a lot of these families joining the German international stream because they know in a couple of years from now or maybe some time from now they're going to move to Germany and they want their children being firm in the German language and being able to follow the German system. First of all, we're working holistic, so it, it means like whenever we do an activity or we do a project, it involves the whole body, so it's everything about body and soul. Ja, also Kinder lernen, durch Ergreifen, Dinge erfassen, mit allen Sinnen, sie lernen nicht nur mit dem Kopf, sie lernen mit ihren Händen, mit ihren Herzen. It's, it's not so much on the academic side for the kindergarten years, it's more on learning through play philosophy, so, so that the children can explore things. This is also very important for our immersion system because whenever we teach a language like German or Mandarin, um, it's not only talking, so it's like we have to move our hands, we have to move our body. From the setup they do a lot of uh, body class activities, it's very easy for them to mingle, they have free play time together, they have festivals together. We do a lot of cultural education uh, to teach them how we do things in Germany about uh, festival days. For example, for PE, then we split the class in half. The first half session will be in German, the other half will be in Mandarin. And activity-wise, the same for arts and crafts, we have stations. So children, children are free to come to us and select an art and craft they want to do with me in Mandarin or with him in German. Either redet erstmal natürlich in seiner Sprache, aber das Deutsch nähert sich an oder versucht wirklich mit Händen und Füßen und, und mit Mimik und Gestik zu arbeiten. So, I would say it's, it's a mixed response. We have all kinds of children in the class. But uh, by Christmas we saw a big learning curve in almost all the children. With the new two bilingual classes we hope to uh, make it easier for families with a different language background or multicultural background to, to start in the, in the German system and make it easier for the students to learn German as a second language. The good thing in the German stream is that we have mixed age classes, so the younger ones learn from the older ones and the older ones learn to uh, treat the younger ones with respect. The biggest focus for us is more like on the social emotional skills and the cognitive skills. We want to actually help them to be as independent as they can from the early ages. So it's more like um, working on their problem solving skills, on conflict management, um, how to cope with social manners. We allerdings uh, bereiten hier viel mehr die Kinder spielerisch darauf vor, um, sich mit der deutschen Sprache auseinanderzusetzen, uh, Satzstrukturen kennenzulernen. I mean, as you know, every child is not ready to read or write at the age of three. So I think this classroom gives them the time to develop in a holistic way. The fine motor activities that we do really strengthens their pre-writing skills. The reason why we do it is more like um, of a psychological base because um, what the German system believes in or what the studies also show is um, the, the wish to read needs to come from the children and the wish to write too. Also it's wonderful how einfach eigentlich Sprache and communication in kindergarten funktioniert, auch wenn die Sprache erstmal vielleicht noch nicht so vorhanden ist. All teachers speak English. Uh, all the communication, email communication is done in German and in English. Um, meetings with parents are conducted in English as soon as somebody is there who doesn't speak any German. And also the German international stream is a through train. So when they start in kindergarten, they can go through to primary and secondary school without any assessments.